All right, folks, we are back. And up next, we've got Heaven's Vault. Uh, I don't know, maybe a puzzle game based on what I'm seeing. Like some, I don't know, looks Middle Eastern, Arabic writing. I don't know. Climb the stone staircase, more ancient than the mind can imagine. Find the cornerstone, and under it, the copper box that is marked with his name. Unlock it, open the lid, take out the tablet of lapis lazuli, read. Epic of Gilgamesh, 1300 BCE. Which looks like they want me to use a controller, so let me get that here. There we go. Let's check this real quick. Uh, not a whole lot we can do. Maybe turn this down a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Stories don't have tidy beginnings. The past is always present. But there has to be a spark. Something that brings the past to light. Please climb carefully. Okay, thank you, robot friend. Uh, it's not too much farther. One last corner. We're almost... At the top. A moment to rest before you walk, mistress, please. Okay. I guess we need to wait for this red bar to fill up. Is that like stamina? I guess. I don't know. We'll, we will wait for it to fill up. They told us to wait. Okay. Well, it still seems to be filling up even though we are walking. A bricked up opening. There is something here. To keep people out, do you think? Or to keep something in? There's something written here. Ancient script. This must have been cut in when the mortar was still wet. I think I can read it. gibberish Evans vault University of Iox 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 I don't know some weeks earlier My story begins on Iox. That was where I met the robot. Okay, so we were right the first time in our pronunciation. Iox. Mistress Alaya. Mistress Alaya Alasara. I've been waiting for you been asked to escort you to Professor Mayari. She is very anxious for your arrival. 
And who are you? I am a robot, mistress, as is apparent. This way. Did she say what she wanted? Yes. She said she wanted you. So why has she sent you? Did you do something wrong? That seems unlikely. <laughs> My ethical core protects me from serious error. Uh, maybe I should get one of those. Presented an impressions humans already had them. Somewhere between the first and second vertebrae. Uh-huh. Do you have a name? Is that intended to be a joke, mistress? This way. You should know that the professor's urgency was remarkable. Look at her. She looks like a tiger in a cage. A most curious analogy, mistress. You understand I will be required to report it. Reply? Required to? Of course. Professor Mayari is my primary user, mistress. Nevertheless, I will try to sugarcoat your opinion. You do that for me? Of course. I have been tasked with your well-being. Shall we proceed? The Tree of Knowledge. Or so they call it. Each branch grows more branches. Except for the ones that die, fall off, and are forgotten. Which is where we come in, I suppose. Why is Mayari's room so far from everything? I imagine she enjoys her view of the tree, mistress. I'm sure it is most pleasing to her. Okay. I was 15 when Mayari rescued me from the slums of Elbereth and brought me here. I'd never seen such luxury or oh such kindness. Went outside the university grounds once exploring. This is a very beautiful moon. I can tell it was once lush, fertile. There must have been huge forests, lakes, rivers. They're all but dry now. You've not been outside? No. Okay. I still don't know why she did it. Professor Mayari? Oh, yeah, there you are. Come in. Uh, I came as soon as I got your message. You don't need to flatter me, Elia. Nonetheless, I'm glad you came. You know, your work is important to you. I'll do what I can to help you, Professor. Thank you, Elia. I appreciate your kindness. You are an expert on history. Tell me what you make of this. It's certainly old. Empire period. Vice is the eagle and the sun. One of the scholars sent this brooch to me. Janaqui Renba. Do you know him? Did you know him? Uh, maybe, I'm not sure. Look at the detail. I see them. Ancient markings. I know they're a hobby of yours, Elia. But can you read them? I've never seen either of these groupings before. But the two words have some common elements, so they must have related meanings. Well... Uh, well, let's see. Holy has less letters. There's like three letters there. Friend, let's go with holy. Holy... Emperor. View. Either that or we could do friend. Beloved? No, no. Definitely emperor. Definitely. Yeah, 
Let's go with Holy Emperor. Holy Emperor? But I'm only guessing. What is this about? Janaquit told me he'd found something. That was more than a month ago. Janaquit isn't like you. He's an Ioxian through and through. You're worried about him. He's important to me. I don't know what he was doing out there. He told me he was going to a moon called Mercy. I can't go hunting the nebula for missing people, Aaliyah, but you can. It's what you do, isn't it? Find things. I'll see what I can dig up. Ha ha ha. Thank you. Come back when you found him, Aaliyah. And Aaliyah, you're taking that robot with you. Thank you, Professor. I long to see the nebula. Oh, and before you go, you should look in on Huang. He was eager to see you. Okay, where is he? Where he always is, I'd imagined. Nose in a book. I know he's rather beneath you. But you could at least say good faith to him for the benefit of our little community. I guess I'll go and find him. He's down there by the tree. You must have walked straight past him on your way in. Good hunting, my dear. I just say, Mr. Celia, it is wonderful to be accompanying you. Oh, yes? And why is that? I find humans fascinating. You are very different to most here. Only recently been activated. I'm calling you Six. Six, Mistress? I shall remember that. wonder if I got Miari's translation correct. I think I did. Shape shows this is an empire piece. Emperor. Alright, that was correct. The emperors believe themselves to be gods, so it makes sense that the words would be almost the same. Hey, that was correct too. We are a, a genius at this game. Look at that. We can be archaeologists slash anthropologists any day of the week. Any day of the week. Aaliyah. I didn't know you were back on Iox. Uh, how are you, Hong? Well enough, well enough. I've been reading all day. Just came outside to rest my eyes, and there you were. What were you reading? The yeah. end. Annals again. Did you know Mazwai claims the Holy Empire was founded by three, each one at the throat of the other, and as the tree fell to earth? Are you really interested? Is it relevant to anything? It's only a story. But then stories change how we think. People choose how they think. But you would say that. You were brought up on Elbreth. I'll walk you to the dock. Tell me, what do you make of this brooch? It's a nice piece. I've not seen anything quite like it. There's something written on the back. An ancient script? Let's see. First word is one I've seen before. It's a descriptive form of the word for God. That's what I thought, too. Holy. Yes, we already know that. Symbology is classic holy empire, of course. The eagle and the sun. Older more, and it seemed heavy to me. 
Heavy brooches hold up heavy cloth. Light brooches hold up light cloth. So it must have belonged to someone important. Uh, I had better go. Good faith to you, Huang. Before you depart, I found a line of ancient in the annals of Mazwe I thought you might like. If you have time, that is. Always. Sure. Here, see what you think. Empress. I know one of these words. I'll have to guess the other two. Uh, Empress... Ugh. Banished rebels. I don't fucking know. I think that's correct. It's quite a monster, isn't it? Something about the Empress? Mazwe is always writing about emperors. I think she was a Republican. Good faith to you. You're not even going to tell me if that was correct or not? Shall we proceed to your ship? Yes, let's get out of here. So we left the hollowed walls of the university. Learn the ancient word for emperor. Learn the ancient word for holy. Should we passage from the annals of Mazwai? Sure continue. I don't know. <laughs> Very peculiar. Aboard the Nightingale. My ship is my refuge. It's the only place that's truly mine. Journey to Mercy should be quick, mistress. Think Mayari's friend is in trouble? As I say, mistress, we should know shortly if we depart. Well, then let's get to it. Hopefully, we'll be in time to help. Whatever has happened to Janakui, I will prepare the ropes. Okay, choose a location. No breath. Yeah. So John Akui told the professor he was going to, but why would he be visiting a rice farm? All right, sure. Plot the course. How do we make it go? Make it go. Sail. What are we sailing? Are we sailing in the water? Are we sailing? In the air? Mayari wanted us to sail to Mayerzi. It was a short sail through fast waters. Water. Okay. Oh, where you are. Turn right, mistress. Okay. Yes. Yes, okay. Deeper currents below. No, I don't want to... Sure. But why are we going that way? I am pushing right trigger. Okay, there we go. Sweep sail. Whoa. This is your ship, mistress? Are we like, we're in the air? Are we in space? What? Yeah, sure. What do you think? She is very beautiful, mistress. 
I can't help wondering how you came by her. <coughs> Found her in a ruined hall on Elbreth, covered in dust. She must have been someone's prized possession once. She's mine now. That's mayor, see? You can see the greenery from here. Whole sequence kind of gives me a Kingdom Hearts gummy ship vibe. All we need is little things shooting at us. <laughs> a farming moon. If Remba's here, I need to find him. And if he's not, I need to work out where he went. Renba, I thought we were looking we for... We stepped off the ship Jada and Queen. into the mud. Mud covered the ground and rock. And everywhere I looked, things were growing from the mud. And some of those things had legs. Look at this place. Breathe the air. I cannot breathe, mistress. Rest assured, I'm most happy for you, all the same. Well then, let's see where Renba's got... I thought we were looking for Janaqui. If we're lucky, he'll have found an old pot. Question. So where do we start? There's a series of rice terraces. If we climb up away from the water, that should take us to the village. Very good. <laughs> hmm. But this way then. The air smelled earthy and sweet. Don't mind me. Just uh, passing through. Aha, here we are. Oh, goodness. The moon seems most poor to me. There are no proper buildings. There is mud everywhere. Never seen fields before? This is how most people live. Did not intend to give offense, mistress. I've never been off Iox before. Forget it, Six. Just maybe keep your voice down a little. Would you recognize Renba if we saw him? Did you meet him? I believe he activated me, mistress, after I was uncovered. I expect that's why Professor Mayari assigned me to you. Up this way. You do a scan for Janaqui or something? Mistress has mistaken me for a dog. Perhaps you believe if I had a scrap of clothing that I could trace his scent. This was what passed for a street on Mayerzi. Buildings on stilts, jumping out of the bushes like children. It was so quiet. So how are we supposed to find him? I have visual scanners of exceptional acuity, Mistress. If I see him, I will let you know. Alright, well, you do that's the way we came. Six, you were buried? Did they find you on Iox? Indeed, mistress. They chipped me out of a wall. Three paths met at the heart of the village. I could imagine them all. Sitting around here in the evenings. Sipping rocker and singing. It seemed nice. Uh, stranger, stranger danger. Uh, greetings. Greetings to you. Welcome to Mercy. You have come to trade. Uh, actually, I'm looking for someone. 
Who? Not a mayor soon, surely. We are uh, as alike to ants as ants to you. Uh, a man named Jonaqui. Not heard of anyone by that name. Good luck with your search. They say the nebula is wide. Helpful. It appears Renba was never here, mistress. Perhaps we should return to the ship. Mayari told me to look, so we're looking. Come on, Six, let's try this way. Good faith to you. My apologies, I ask you. My pigs need me. Please, if you could just... No one wants to talk to us. Did I do something wrong? You came here. Perhaps that is all. The locals don't seem surprised to see me. Or to see you. Imagine robots collect supplies from here routinely. The locals I don't also do not seem pleased to see you. Mm -hmm. I think that just kind of looped us right back. Yeah, if Rambo's here, someone must have seen him. This place is small and full of people. It's this way. My ox. My name is Elia. Then you are not her. Not Mayari. That's who you're waiting for? I heard your voice. You're Ioxium. But you said Elia. My name is Elia Mayari. Do you have a message for me? He told me you might come. Who did? My tall Ioxian. He left something for you. With the goddess to keep it safe. What did he leave? He said it would show you the way, Mayari. Good faith to you. I hope you find him, Miss Mayari. Uh, Jean-Aquie left something with the goddess, did he? Now why would he do a thing like that? Okay, where do I get said thing? What did you make of Renba's brooch, Six? The one he sent to Mayari. I was struck by the craftsmanship. It seemed very fine to me. It is an artisanal product. High status. How high status? Hard to say. Possibly very high. So it's valuable. Most likely. Mistress surely does not intend to sell it. No. <coughs> the question is, where did Renba get it? Do you know what Renba taught? Robotics, mistress. Did you ever talk to him? He interviewed me shortly after my activation. That memory is somewhat hazy, however. What is he like? Remba. Could not judge him, mistress. The interview was largely technical. He was mostly concerned with ensuring my vision wasn't at the lines of his expectation of gravity. Good faith. Please keep it quick. I don't want to talk to you. I'm looking for someone. My Oxian man called Janaki Remba. Expecting to find him hiding behind a tree? <laughs> you don't like Ioxians here, do you? That's no secret. Return to your moon. 
leave us in peace. Right. Another thing. Yes? Ash on the brooch. Do you recognize this? I recognize the symbol of our Ioxian masters, of course. But do you recognize this brooch? No. No one here would own a brooch like that. Not every slave must wear their chains. I know my friend Jonaqui was here. I met one of your villagers. She knew him. She? What was her name, this villager? She didn't say. No matter. I can guess. If we had seen your friend, if he had met with an accident among us, what would Iox do? I, I, I just want to know where he is. We have not seen him. Now leave. I don't understand why you're lying to me. The man sighed. Your friend was here. He left in a ship. And something exploded in the sky. I do not know if that was your friend, but I do know we found this close beside our goddess. Here. Shard of crystal. Does it mean anything to you, Six? It is most curious. This moon does not contain any crystals of this type. New site indicated. Indications of the crystal moon somewhere in the cyclones. Okay. What kind of crystal is it, Six? Iolite, mistress. Valueless. Thank you for this. You are welcome. Tell your Ioxian masters, the Arsians are still gracious despite all. Good faith to you, lady. Seems as if Renba left and has left us. Shall we leave? Let's go. This way, mistress. So we left the warm, wet fields of Mercy. Okay. Lord the Nightingale. Remba left a crystal for Mayari to find, but what was he trying to tell her? We could otherwise sail to Iox and tell Mayari what we've learned so far about Renba. I'm quite certain in my analysis, mistress. So where's it from? I believe this shard comes from an asteroid somewhere on the edge of the cyclones. I've never been that way. No one has. Those are wild rivers. Wonder what exactly did Remba discover? You better find out. Put out the sails, six. Renaki has uh, never been there. Okay. Alright, so yeah, this is like an exploration puzzle game. Like some weird timeline thing going on. I don't know. Um, kind of interesting. Not really my thing. So, we're going to wrap it up here. Thank you all for watching, as always. I believe this was called Heaven's Vault. So we will see you in the next one when we come back with whatever's next.